And the reason why, why I'm vehemently expressing that, that wind and solar are a big problem at grid scale is actually not only the intermittency, that you know that the sun doesn't always shine, the wind doesn't always blow. There's two other problems. The second problem is the energy density, right? The energy density, that means the amount of energy you can collect per square meter is limited by nature. That's energy density, right? So, right. so um, and that energy density you cannot change with technology. You see, think about it, the, the sun shines and this, this, this energy of the sun is unlimited, we agree. And it would be beautiful if you can, can harness it, it would be amazing. But the fact is on our planet, only very little energy, dilute energy comes per square meter when the sun shines. And that means we have to now build this infrastructure to collect this free energy, this huge infrastructure. Right, by the way, coal from the ground is also free energy I get from the ground. It's not unlimited right. as the sun is, I understand that. Uh, tr trust me, I understand that. But of course, I, I, I now have to collect this solar energy or this wind energy and have to build this infrastructure. And so, so now you start to understand, you have the intermittency plus you have the density. That's actually the fundamental problem because the density means I need to have a huge investment, not only of money, but also of infrastructure. It means raw materials and energy. I have to actually invest energy to build this infrastructure. Right. And I've built now infrastructure that lasts not 50 years like a coal or gas power plant or 60 years. No. It lasts, actually, the modern solar panels last 10, 13, maybe 15 years if you're lucky. The old ones lasted 25 years, but not the new ones, right? They're so thin and so optimized. So you're building infrastructure that only lasts, you know, a few years, but you have to replace it three times more than a coal, gas, and nuclear power station. Until you see a hailstorm in Texas, and then it gets wiped storm, right? out. All those things. And, and uh, so, so the third key problem is this lifetime, what I call the lifetime, operational lifetime, right? So you have intermittency the density and the lifetime. And those three things you really cannot change with technology.